I'm uh, I'm not excited about making this video. I'm you know, in all of the other times that we've moved animals from place to place or we rescue an animal or we you know, whatever we had done, whatever was going on, I was always excited to make the video to yeah, look what we're doing, look what we've done, look what's happening, you know. But um I'm, I'm, this is not what I ever foresaw my adventure into, you know, raising the Longhorns was going to look like. But this is where we're at. So, come on, let me show you what we're doing today. Let me show you what we're doing today. All right, boys. Y'all need to hold on for the ride, okay? Waylon looks terrified. Waylon, you look terrified. <laughs> Waylon, such a good boy. Uh, Santoro, you be sweet. We're taking a little ride, okay? And next stop, Santoro, you're going to see Daddy. Waylon, you're going to meet your dad-in-law. And I hope that you can make a, your best impression, okay? I really do hope you can make your best impression. You guys, we're taking these fellas for a little ride, and uh, I believe you all know why. Our pastures are burnt to the ground. They're burnt crisp here, uh, just sun parched. And so we're taking them, not to greener pastures, but where Daddy can keep an eye on them. So y'all ride along with us. Well, this ought to be interesting to see how Tex reacts to his new bunk mates. Uh, I don't see Tex from right here, but I can promise you once he finds out there's friends, he's going to come a running. Stretch it out, Daddy. <laughs> All right, boys. Come on out. There you go. Nice, Santoro. Come on, Waylon. Texas is not that bad. All right, so now it's going to be interesting to see how Tex reacts to the fellas. Uh, they're both going to take a second to look around they need to figure out what's what now don't forget santoro's already been here he was raised here this will be F Waylon's first time to visit longhorn lester's and this is just a visit my friends this is just a visit Waylon's gonna check out the fresh water he goes man this stuff tastes pretty good but what in the hell is that what is that thing now Waylon has never seen an ostrich <laughs> <laughs> Look at Santoro. Santoro knows his way around. He's going to go say hi to his dad. Let me close this gate and we'll go down and watch, y'all. You know what's kind of funny is? Tex has seen Santoro and care less. Tex sees Waylon and is not happy. Waylon, don't go down there. Waylon, we don't go down into the ditch, Waylon. Oh my gosh. Waylon's in the ditch. Santoro, Santoro, show him his way around. Now what we don't want is Tex in the ditch. What we don't want is anyone fighting. So, oh, Lord. <laughs> Seriously, Santoro, that's your dad. The 
This will only take a second, friends. Let them establish the hierarchy here. <sighs> Guys, I'll tell you what he got. Tex knows he's a young <laughs> bull. There's nothing to fight over. What a brave little guy. Seriously. Look at Tex. Arched his back, shoulders are high, head is up, and suddenly this bull has life again. Guys, they're going to be fine, okay? There's nothing to fight over. Tex probably smells the ladies on him from back home. He goes, you smell like, wait a minute. <laughs> hey, wait a minute, that's my daughter I think I smell on you. I want them to get out of the rocks, as the rocks are not good for their feet, obviously. So there's a lot of posturing, just trying to establish a hierarchy of who's who and what's what. And guys, it won't take but a minute, I promise you. And I don't think either one of the bulls will dare challenge Tex because they know that'd be foolish. But um, isn't his size impressive compared to the two younger ones? Oh, I think he's welcoming him. Guys, he's welcoming him. He's welcoming a friend is what he's doing. Welcome to Longhorn Lester's. This place was bought for me. There's just no grass here for now, but dad's working on it. Anyway, there's a nice shade trees here. Uh, dad brings out plenty of dry hay and we get fed grains at least once a day, sometimes twice if we're lucky. So, you're the one who's been talking to my daughters and my granddaughter, eh? Wanda? I'm watching the bulls, Wanda. Nobody wants to watch that old silly ostrich right now, okay? Here. You happy? There. Wanda, move. Don't have time for this right now, Wanda. Sweetie, I don't have... Oh, Guys, just ignore her and she'll go away. Wanda, people can't focus. Wanda, no one can focus right now. If you'll just walk away. Oh, Wanda. Wanda, go away. Get out of here, you stupid ball. Stop it. Walk away from me. Go away. Tina, don't even come over here messing with her. Just get your behind out of here. Go. Just get on. Get on out of here, y'all. I'm trying to watch the bulls. Well, friends, there you have it. The boys have found their way to the shade. It'll take a couple of hours to everyone to kind of figure out who's who and what's what. But uh, there's no fighting going on. A little bit of bumping heads here and there, and we're good. I uh, will continue to bring you videos of how the boys are adjusting to everything and how they're doing physically. I want to thank you for being understanding to our situation. Realizing that uh, if things had gone the way we hoped they would have, then we would have Tex with his family here. Wayland would have his family back over at I'm a Survivor. But, you know, remember that you don't really make the plans God does. And we're all subject to just doing things as uh, we are guided. I'll say guided. Or sometimes pushed. <laughs> But uh, thank y'all for watching. The bulls are going to be fine. 
You know, I will say this. They call it pasture art. Pasture art. Can you imagine when cars drive by as these fellas stand there alongside the road? What neat, really, what neat things people will have to look at and talk about. and Kids can look out their windows. Just amazing and magnificent creatures. <sighs> oh, and then of course, then you got all these goofballs. You have all these goofballs that just kind of ruin everything. <laughs> Close your mouths. But uh, we keep the water fresh here, y'all. The water's clean. And we got the pond filling up. We'll start irrigating and we'll have grass hopefully sooner rather than later. All right, and we'll, we'll go from there. What's to happen next? We will just go from there, friends. Thank you all for watching, and we will catch you on the next video. Don't let your troubles fester. Come watch Longhorn Lester. <laughs> yeah, something like that.